Hi guys, uh, welcome to Film Company in South. So I've just got home after a show of uh, Paris Jalaj, a film I was really excited about for a very very long time, and that's because I enjoyed A1 like anything. I went in expecting another movie like Dilak Dudu or something like that, but when I went to it, when it just started working, I was laughing so much that I thought I was going to start crying. uh entering paris jeraj i i was like like i said i was very excited but for the most part it was extremely 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 boring for the first 45 50 minutes or so you have no clue what's happening you see a lawyer who is supposed to be santanam's dad who's trying to uh get people separated and you you feel you you get a sense that he's meeting this girl and they're going to start having a relationship and all that but for the most part it's just one rhyming joke after another it just never never stops and it's not funny after the first two or three jokes uh, you feel the film is going nowhere and right at the interval point the interval block is when the plot really starts kicking in from there on it just becomes another film you shouldn't go into this film expecting a lot but when the jokes start coming it just never stops it's hilarious uh, i don't know if it's the kind of humor that you guys might enjoy but i loved it it's not adult humor it's adultery humor into 10 it just never stops so i uh, in telling you a, a single word more would be a huge spoiler because basically the entire film revolves around one particular plot point when everything everything that's funny in the movie also comes from this so there's very little i can tell you in terms of plot but there is a hilarious situation exactly like like in the first film where everybody kind of lands up in the same place in the first film it was it was a, it was a house it was a house after somebody had just died here it's it's a wedding place it's a temple where a lot of weddings are happening and from there on it just keeps going up and up and up and it just never stops like i said these guys have just ha- they have an other brand of really silly absurd humor where you are laughing with the film you are laughing at the film and more importantly you are laughing at yourself because you are finding you are finding it so silly that you are finding the movie funny so that's what i thought about paris gerard you guys tell me what you you think if you haven't already watched a1 watch it and then maybe try paris gerard if a1 doesn't work for you this film is certainly not going to work for you because it's definitely two or three steps uh, lesser than a1 santanam is again like in in his zone when the film really works if you like this video please hit like and subscribe to film companion sir